Hello everyone. So in today's video, I'll show you guys on how to use ChatGPT with Google Assistant. So first, go to the Chrome Web Store and search for ChatGPT for Google. And once you've searched it, you can now add it as extension. Once you've added it as extension, you can now start using it. So for example, let's search on how to bake a cake. And this will be the Google results, and this right here will be the ChatGPT results. So the advantage of this is that you don't need to click on any links on, on to search on how to bake a cake because ChatGPT will just display it right here. What you can also do is you can let ChatGPT make you a letter. So for example, let's say, make me a letter for my friend John so as you can see over here chat GPT is going to make a letter so it says here to get started could you please provide me more details about the content and purpose of the letter so let's say make it an appreciation letter And as you can see, ChatGPT will start making your letter. So that's pretty much it on how to use ChatGPT for Google. What you can also do is, you can also talk with ChatGPT. So all you have to do is go to the Chrome Web Store again and search for Talk to ChatGPT. Once you've added it as an extension, go to the ChatGPT website. Once you're there, once you're there you can see this this control panel at the top right corner so just click on start and you can now start to talk with it so hello 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 it seems like you're trying to start a conversation and i'm here to help how can i assist you today give me recipes on how to bake a cake certainly Here's a basic recipe for a classic vanilla sponge cake. You can customize it with your favorite frosting and decorations. Ingredients. So that's pretty much it. So that's how you use Talk to Chat GPT on Google. So that's pretty much it. So hope you guys enjoyed the video. Don't forget to like and subscribe for more tech tips.